Why, hello there, sir. How are you? Uh, yeah, I figured we would do this. Because it's Sunday, and that means that tomorrow is another work week. And as we've been discussing, things tend to get busy at that point. Uh, yeah, so I'm at the point in my year where I've kind of, I've calmed down a little bit in terms of looking at the work. I'm as confident as I possibly can be that everything is going to get taken care of. But there's just like every week now going forward, I can look at my, my calendar and I can see that there's multiple days um, where I'm not going to be coming home after school. That's fine. It's basically par for the course. I mean, it's been true since the beginning of the year. But I think at this point in the year, you get to this point where you're like, you can see the light at the end of the tunnel. And so every week that you look and you have something that's keeping you from coming home right after school is a week where you are just kind of scratching it off of the list as you get down to the end. So uh, looking forward to putting in another week and scratching it off the list again. Uh, it's parent conference week at Deer Park High School this week. This is the spring parent conferences. When I was uh, doing this in the fall, I had to leave. I had to leave about an hour and a half into it because I got a call from home that was like, we've got a problem with the child. You need to come home and deal with the problem. And I was more than happy to do that. And uh, so I missed some parents, but I may, I, you know, I called them the next day and that kind of thing and just kind of went from there. Um, but so anyway, so that's going down on Thursday and uh, five to eight. And I'm basically booked through, although I've got a little bit of time at the end. That's going to happen. And I've got other things going on this week, too. Um, you know, uh, I wrote a piece, you may have seen it, you may not have, where the uh, the grad school application that we talked about in uh, the Christmas time dinner that we had, uh, that just didn't happen. So uh, it looks like we are sticking around here at least for another year in the sequence that's fine by us. What is? It also means that I can purchase a Wii U because we were waiting to probably move and see what kind of time I had available to me. But at least for the next year or so, it looks like I have some time for Wii U's. So I'm going to go and get myself a Wii U and seed it to my child at some point. Uh, we were thinking about the PlayStation 4, but that's not really for the kid. You know, I don't even think the Wii U is really for the kid at this point, but at least if he's going to grow into a system, he should grow into the family friendliness that is the Nintendo Empire. Just kind of hunkering down and doing what we have to do. I, I appreciated that from your own post. You know, you, you got to deal with the flies. You got to deal with the flies. There's nothing you can do except to deal with them. So you just got to kind of keep de dealing with them. I, I, I like the way that you shot the last video, although, um, and I'm sure you probably know this, when you film yourself on your phone, which is what I'm assuming you were doing, uh, you just got to tilt that bad boy so you get a nice wide frame instead of the sliver. Uh, yeah, that's like a pet peeve of uh, the person I live with, and she let me know. So uh, I'm letting you know, because that's what we call marriage. So uh, yeah, that's it. Um, not, not too much else to report, just kind of going along, uh, doing the thing. Oh, I know what I wanted to talk to you about. I don't know if you've seen this or not, but there's this thing called the Artiphone Instrument One. Have you seen this? Uh, they just launched a Kickstarter the other day. It's been in development for a little while. Um, I want you to watch the video. I will link to the video down below. And I want you to uh, tell me what you think about the Artiphone Instrument One, if it seems like something that's interesting to you or not. I've got some feelings on it, and uh, I would like to know what your feelings are. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna leave that for you until uh, we speak again in the future. All right, boss, take it easy. Bye. You're crazy.